What's up, Sagittarius? Welcome back. For those of you that are new and cross-watchers, I'm so grateful you're here. We are going to get into Sagittarius's reading, and this is for Sagittarius Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Placement. We are. I'm still giving away that $100 gift card. Um, so the giveaway is going to go on to, to the 15th of December. All I need you to do is to become a subscriber to take part in the giveaway. Um, and leave a gift emoji in the comment section of each reading that you view of mine. Each month I do a giveaway. Um, January is going to be a couple personal readings that I'm giving away for free. So to take part in these giveaways, you need to become a subscriber. And like I said, for the December, leave a gift emoji. Around the 15th, that weekend, I'm going to remind everyone that participated to be checking their notifications through YouTube because one person will be hearing from me. And then we'll begin the January giveaway that, you know, right after um, that one person gets back to me. I'm ending it a little bit earlier so I have that time to get the gift card to the person in time for the holidays. All right. We are going to see what messages Spirit wants to bring through for you, Sagittarius. There's something better. And if you notice, it's like this angel wants to hand over all these blessings to you. This good fortune. All right. And what else do you have, Spirit, for my Sagittarians? And peaceful resolution. There is going to be an outcome, a positive, peaceful outcome. And look, as soon as I cut the deck, there is angel love and having faith. All right, let's see what comes out. Spirit, what do you have for my Sagittarians? All right, three popped out. We're going to take all three. Angel of Communication. And as that came out, so there's something better. At the bottom of the deck, it did say Communicate Clearly. And now we have Angel of Communication coming out. Angel of Gratitude. Keeping that energy the best that you can. Being in the energy of attitude is gratitude. You know, every day before you get out of bed, think of something that you feel blessed for. Thank the universe. Thank your spirit guides. Just, just have it within your heart that attitude is gratitude. You know, just feeling blessed for the outcomes that turned out the way you didn't want to, the lessons that you learned, the ebbs and flows within your life. It makes you so much stronger. And there's blessings within those situations, even though you may not see it, in the moment, an angel of grounding. I really feel like for some of you, you are so, you've had this like transition. You've become even deep, you know, deeper connected with your spirit guides. So connected to the universe. Um, and I feel a brand new beginning here for you. Communication coming in that's going to allow for a brand new beginning. Spirit, what else do you have? What is coming towards? I felt like one flipped over. No. What is coming towards my Sagittarians? Digging deeper. There's more to learn. And warm embrace. You're about to experience a very deep connection with someone. The Nine of Pentacles, getting ready to reap the rewards of all of your hard labor. The Nine of Cups. 
the Emperor, Queen of Pentacles, Judgment. For some of you, you've been really hard at work, um, at work or within your career. And there is great fortune that's going to find its way on your path. A lot of, it's like you're starting to feel like everything is falling into place, um, wish fulfillment within your place of work. It's like you've really shown up here with the emperor in the middle of the deck. You've shown up. You've put in those extra hours. You've worked extremely hard. You let people know that you're interested in something higher, you know, a higher level of job position or You've worked just, you've put in the time, you've put in the sweat, and you've put in the labor. And there's a blessing that's divinely orchestrated coming your way. Remember, angel of communication is here. So there is an offer coming in that feels like a wish being granted. It feels like a miracle. I really feel luck is on your side. I also feel that there's comfort all around you. Support and comfort. Where you might have been struggling, I feel it's very short-lived. There's a huge transition coming in. It's like the door to opportunity is opening up and showering in these miracles for you. The Four of Cups, the Page of Swords, the Empress. Do you see this Emperor and Empress right here, right above one another? In terms of love, I feel like there is an, a relationship that's about to evolve. This blessing that's coming towards you, whether a career-based or relationship-based, it is divinely guided. The, the Your spirit guides are bringing in these blessings to you. And there's so much happiness that awaits. You know, the struggle that you've been through, the struggles that you've been through and how you've been, you know, trudging on and you're like, you know, I know my ships are about to come in if I just keep putting in more effort. You know, I just see so many successful, happy people around me. When is it going to be my time? It, there were still lessons that you were going through. You know, still things along your path that you were meant to experience. A lot of growth within you. And because you're living through the energy of attitude is gratitude, 13, 14, because you're raising up your energy and moving forward, such a huge blessing. For some of you, you're evolving with your twin flame. Could even be a soulmate union coming into play here. I just feel someone sees you moving on. Some, someone sees you doing very well for yourself. They're watching from afar. They're thinking long-term about you, like being with you long-term. And I feel it's divinely orchestrated that this blessing is coming towards you. All right, let's see what else I can get. We do have fire energy here. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We have Libra. We have Taurus. Virgo. Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, let's say. Yeah, I feel like there has been an ending here. And it's caused a lot of soul searching and self-evaluating. I feel something left you feeling very defeated, Sagittarius. 
But since then, like I said, internally, you've been going through a lot of evolving. And you are moving towards success. And like I said, there is a soulmate union. You already know this person. And you, it is a wish granted. It is going to feel like a dream come true that you evolve with this person. I am feeling a second chance here. Someone coming in that you already know, that you've already experienced a connection with. It doesn't have to be an ex, but some form of connection um, that you were in, that you've, you know, and it, it's evolving. It is going to feel like a wish granted. You are about to feel this in warm embrace, warm embrace, peaceful resolution. I feel two people getting to know each other on such a deeper level. Really evolving, coming together, being completely honest with one another and opening up to each other. Like I said, Sagittarius, remember, it is divinely orchestrated. And I feel for those of you that are experiencing a twin flame connection, like I said, I feel evolving between the two of you. Getting through your ebbs and flows to unite. All right, Spirit, what else do you have? What is this communication coming in for Sagittarius? Look at this. When you're out and about running errands, it's possible you run into someone very special. Someone you already know. If you're invited to a party or a work party, I would say go. Get out. Enjoy yourself. Someone is about to ask you out on a date. There's about to be communication. And there is that, it, it, there is those complications. Things that felt like obstacles within your energy. But you're overcoming them, Sagittarius. And Spirit saying, wait, things will unfold naturally. Now, we have the snowflake and we have the wreath within the Six of Wands. So you obviously know I'm doing this around the holiday season. Something is coming in that's being divinely orchestrated. It, need to, it needs to be handled with care. But it's because you are as unique as you are. It's like you deserve this perfect blessing that's coming your way. Whether it be a job offer or a promotion. Whether it be the evolving of, of relationship. And there it is. The star card. We have the star twice and the nine of cups twice. Within two to four weeks for some of you. During the winter. January 22nd to February 21st. Spirit, what is this blessing? Why is the star here twice and the nine of cups here twice? All right. Thank you. Look at this. You are drawing in what your heart desires. It might have taken some time to get to you, some time to arrive on your path, but you were taking these baby steps all along. You've been growing, healing, evolving, following the lantern, which is your spirit guides, and following your heart's desire. You're moving towards a faded moment. And you've got, it's just, for some of you, it is a very strong soul connection with someone. Something that you've been longing for, that you've been desiring that you've been manifesting within your head is attitude is gratitude. Something you want. Think about, bring about. Come on in. Okay, baby. It's fluffed. I promise. Something that you've been thinking on that you want for your future is coming right on your path. 
so get ready to receive it. And for some of you, it's going to be that warm embrace that you've been waiting on. We have H, V, J, U, C, T, E, O, N, M, S, I. So do take what resonates, Sagittarius. Let me know how it re resonates. Leave that gift emoji down below in the comment section. Um, let me know. The link to my Etsy shop is in the description box of each and every reading. It is still open. It is still stocked. I am getting a little overwhelmed with readings, but I'm still delivering within the 7 to 14 day turnaround time unless you purchase the expedited reading. And obviously you're getting that within 48 hours. But my shop will remain open as long as I can keep up with the turnaround time and that I can still get done things for my holiday season. Um, but yeah, I'm sending you so much love and light. And I will be posting your year ahead reading for 2024 shortly. So keep an eye open for that. But I also often the 2024 forecast in my Etsy shop. That way I'm tuning into just your energy. And it does include love career, stability, overall messages that need to come through for you for 2024. All right, so much love and light, guys.